am Robin Denson, your Pierce County Council person, and I am riding the Holiday Shuttle today. You can see the stop sign right behind me. I'm starting off at the Long Branch Improvement Club, way down on the Key Peninsula, a beautiful WPA building, but you can get on and off the shuttle anywhere along its 11 stops through Key Peninsula and all around Gig Harbor. It runs Saturdays and Sundays through Christmas Eve. It's frequent, it's festive, and it's fun. And I hope to see you on the Holiday Shuttle. Join me. Okay, here we go. Good morning. Good morning. We are here at stop two at Evergreen Elementary, which is actually not right at the school. It's at the Hugh McMillan Community Center. So you can see that here, and I'm gonna hop right back on the bus. Okay. Here we are coming up to the community, Key Peninsula Community Services built. Oh my gosh, who's out here to get on the holiday shuttle? What's this? Wow, it's the unicorns getting on the holiday shuttle right here at Key Peninsula Community Services. Happy holidays, unicorns! Wow, this unicorn has some candy canes. This unicorn is clearly going shopping. All right, so let me give you a quick orientation. Here is the sign right here on the corner. You can pull right in to Key Peninsula Community Services. There's lots of parking. So this is a great stop to get on to the holiday shuttle. All right, well, let's get back aboard while the unicorns settle themselves and we will we will get on the road for some shopping and holiday fun okay here we are at the key peninsula middle school stop so you just pull in right off key peninsula highway you can see the sign here and there is a couple different um areas for you to park and then you can hop back on the bus or or on the bus if this is your first stop and head into Key Center. Well, and here's my I... friend, Ellen. Hi, Ellen, welcome to the Holiday Shuttle. Hi. Happy welcome. Holidays. Glad to be here. This is Preston, our driver, and Chris, our driver tomorrow, so he's training. How was your day? It's been great so far. <laughs> All right, well, thanks for riding with me. All right, now we are at Lake Catherine. So I'm sure this is gonna be a destination for a lot of you. We have over here the Dollar Store, which is great for the holidays coming. Um, Domino's Pizza, we've got Cost Plus Pharmacy, which is a great place for shopping, and the New Ace Hardware as well. So this might be a wonderful place for you to get on or off the shuttle for your holiday sh shopping. Okay, here we are at Costco in Gig Harbor North. So this sign is right over here by, I think this is Walgreens, right over here. Just to orient you, there's lots of parking here, obviously. So we're kind of across that little access road. Costco is right behind me, so you can get off here. Oh, I know, Crumble Cookies is right over here, so that'll help you find us. You can see it right there. Yeah, so you can stop off here, have plenty of time to look at Costco, grab some cookies. My son's favorite restaurant in Gig Harbor is Panda Express, <laughs> right down the road. So you might check out there as well. And then of course, across the street, you've got Target and Albertsons and you know, so much shopping here. All right, back on the bus. We are going past Donkey Creek Park. I wanna let you know that there are all sorts of holiday photo opportunities down here. This is free, so bring your family by. And this is another opportunity to just let you know that downtown is a great stop for the holiday shuttle. You can go to the museum, you can go to all of our shops and restaurants, the new Seven Seas. I learned that Heritage Distilling is the most popular stop. Of course, people can hop out there and go to all sorts of places downtown. It's a flag stop, so you will need to wave the trolley down, but they know to watch out for people. Okay, we are driving through downtown Gig Harbor, and the holiday shuttle will pick people up along here. You just have to flag it down, so make sure that you give a wave as the bus is going past. They particularly look for people at the stop sign near Heritage Distilling, and they let me know today that that is the most popular stop. Maybe people going to Heritage or going to Seven Seas or walking downtown to visit all of the wonderful shops and restaurants in Gig Harbor. Well, here's a fun stop. We are in Gig Harbor at the the development that has Ross and Ulta Beauty and Cutter's Point Coffee. 
can see the sign here is right in front of, I think it's in front of Ulta actually, which is one of my daughter's favorite shops. So this is a great place to get some shopping done in Gate Harbor. You might know the McDonald's is over here as well. Yes, so back on the bus. Okay, we are now at the Fred Meyer stop. So this is where I usually shop, Albertsons too, but usually Fred Meyer. Here's the stop sign. It's kind of as you are looking at Fred Meyer on the right side. So you can see that kind of, kind of towards the end of the building. There's also Petco here. If you have um, some pet needs and Ocean 5, you could bring the kids or the grandkids down for some duck pin bowling or arcades. So there's lots to do right here in this area. Wells Fargo, the bank, hops and drops. It's a great stop for you as well. Okay, now we are at Uptown Gig Harbor. So there are so many things here. I'm gonna show you the stop sign right over there. So it's kind of near Cascade Eye and Skin Center, right outside of Safeway. Safeway is right behind me. So you'll wanna park and pick up the shuttle there or that's where it will drop you off. So here, of course, we've got Safeway. We have Michaels and Coles. Then you can walk over to the other part of Uptown where there's everything. My favorite home goods store, Marshalls. You've got, you know, jewelry and lots of restaurants. Um, Fondies, Panera, there is so much over there. So this is gonna be a really great stop for you to get your holiday shopping done. And this is um, the final stop in Gig Harbor before we start heading back to the KP and doing it all over again.